I'm going to do a little modification to this arbor press. See it here, uh, when you come up, see how you kind of get hung here. So when you come down and try to press against something, uh, you have to, you know, your, your optimal angle is is somewhere in here, you know, to, to be able to just apply force. But uh, you can't really get that angle depending on what piece you have in here. You're going to have wherever this press comes down on. I'll show you a little modification that I've seen that uh, will change that. So, hold on. Alright, so we're back. We've taken it apart. You can see the, uh, the gear in here that actually runs the rack up and down. And what we're going to do to get this to be fully adjustable, to get our stopping point wherever we want, is we're going to take uh, these two teeth and just grind them off. Alright? Alright guys, so we're back. You can see that I have ground down the last two teeth. Um, I do recommend, you know, wearing your safety glasses and uh, maybe even a little hearing protection. I use the DeWalt four and a half inch uh, angle grinder, the palm switch, which is really nice. I love this little switcher. Um, but anyways, so that's what it looks like once you get it ground down and then uh, we'll reassemble it and take a look at how it works. All right, so we're back. So here's the press. I've got it all reassembled. You can see that now when you bring it to the top, it'll do that kind of knocking, clicking sound. But what that does is we put our, say we put our piece in here, roll it around, and we don't, we don't have an optimal pulling or, or an optimal pulling angle right now. But if you bring it back up, let it do a little clicks, now you're right here where you can get max pressure. So that just, all this does is just basically allow it, here if you come around to this side, basically it allows you to be able to rotate the handle into a position that will work the best for you. So it's, it's really kind of a nice modification. So I mean wherever you want to position this handle now it's easy to do by just grinding those last two teeth off. So as always, thanks again for watching.